The observer is gone? What happened? Hi everyone, my name is Mike Rennick, the team lead, the senior broker of Team Rennick, part of that great Mangrove Realty Associates family. My guest today is Mr. Steve Reed. Hey Welcome, Mike. Steve. Welcome. No, no handshakes. Um, got a cold today, so wrestling with that with a voice inflection, I apologize. The Observer. We're standing in front of the Longboat Key office. Yep. There's, there's no sign. What happened? Well, I'm uh, here to report the uh, Longboat Observer, and this is the this is where really the founder Ralph Hunter had his headquarters. Then the Observer Group emerged uh, when the Walsh family bought it. Mm -hmm. I actually started 27 years ago. I worked here for a couple of years in this building. And it's sold. They sold. They, they're still in business. Their headquarters are, I, I believe, downtown Sarasota. And the, There's still a vibrant newspaper on the island. So, but, but they're leaving the Longboat Key presence. They've left, the, uh, they've left this building. They sold it to Harry's Continental Kitchens. And Harry's, I love Harry's. When I work here, my favorite thing to do would be walk over to Harry's and get a crab cake sandwich at the deli or the turkey with the cranberry sauce at the deli. For those who are familiar with Longbow Key, they are an institution. Well, you've um, got the party store, you've got the restaurant, you've got the deli. It, 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 one of the things, and this is a little bit of a side, but I like at certain times to give out gift baskets. Yeah. And you order the online gift baskets and they're filled with things that look pretty but nobody ever wants. Right. Here they put in really good stuff. Great wine. And, and not only that, it's a family business. You have Harry and his wife, Lynn, who came down here and started it. He was a chef. I think he came out of the colony. And then the son, Hal, is, is, is sort of the next generation, and he's running much of the operation now. But let's give a little synopsis. This gives them some critical real estate on Gulf of Mexico Drive. It abuts the corner store. Behind the corner store is the restaurant. On Longbow Key, if you own a restaurant, there's two things you need. Parking, if you want to expand. Oh, yeah. And you need to be able to do outdoor dining. People love to... So this opens up a world of possibilities for Harry and the future generation of that restaurant. I mean, this may become a site, obviously, right away. It opens up more parking. Mm -hmm. They can put staff here. They can have people park across the street. Harry was smart. Years ago, he bought the duplex across from the deli. So he owns a nice chunk of this roadway on both sides. And I think that we're going to be coming back in the spring. He's, I talked to Harry, you know, a lot of what, if you say, what are you going to do? Harry's going to say, well, little depends on what the town will right. allow me yeah. to do. So he has a process. But this is big news. Well, here's what we have. We have a business, I won't say business owner, we have a business family that's well respected on the island that are continuing to invest in the future of Longboat. They are. They are. They're, they're growing. Great things are going to happen. That's why we wanted to bring you this story. The island will continue to evolve. It will change. The St. Regis is coming, things like that. But as it does, it's under a controlled atmosphere, so it evolves the right way. And we keep the ambiance that we had here. This is exciting news as Harry decides to expand, maybe some more offerings. Who knows where this is going to lead? I think, and also as a, as a personal note, I, I think like a place like Harry's, I recommend a viewer come here, drive here, go to the restaurant, mm -hmm. get something at the deli, check this place out. If you haven't eaten at Harry's, you, you haven't experienced some, some of the oh, best absolutely. food on the island. In, in the party in the region. store, there's, there's yeah. not a lot of party stores on the island. In fact, this is the only one. It's nice when you're out working, you stop in, get a, a bottle of soda if you want, if you're thirsty. It's just, it's sandwich. It's just really good. Yeah, and everything's a notch above. You yeah. know, it's not the 7 Eleven. That's right. You know what I mean? It's not a slushy machine and bad coffee. It's this is great food. Owned. It is. Everything's homemade. They've got the most amazing. Pay I'm in love with the place. I can, you can and eat. I haven't had breakfast, so be careful. I want 2,000 calories from Harry's right after this is over. It's the best place around. It is. So, so well, let's come back with an update. Let's do it. Keep everyone posted. Thanks for watching another edition of Out and Around with Mike. It's my promise to bring you the aspects of Florida's West Coast from the eyes of the folks that live here, play here, and work here. We'll be back again with another edition. Take care, everyone. Crab cake sandwich. Thank you. <laughs>